Hey guys, I just got my brand new Dangerous Power E1. So first, I'll open it. One sec. So right out of the box, got the manual. With all the parts and everything. Then, all the instructions, got your warranty, you gotta write all that information in, like first name, all that. Then, here's the actual gun. I'll just get the barrel out here. I'll just put you down for a second. Oh yeah. Next, in the gun, you got all your bolts and O-rings, and lastly, your, your barrel cover. Now, when I first got this gun, I did not know, I knew how to turn it on and everything. First of all, I've already done this, but you go in your container of stuff, on fact. And you get the medium Allen wrench, and then you undo all these, and then you put your 9 volt battery back in, and then do it up. I would do it, but it's a pain to put back on. Now, I already put my battery in, so I got my 9 volt on. Hold it for a couple seconds, see the green light. Now, that is semi. And I took me a while to figure this out, but if you want auto, turn it off. Oh wait, never mind. You just, if it flashes slow like that, that's semi. But like that, it's auto. So oh, never mind. I just gotta turn it off. So you look for the yellow light. Now the way you make it auto is you hold the trigger down, and then you hold it. Now when it first starts off it'll be semi but then if you hold it for about two seconds you'll see it's flashing really fast and then you can hear it clicking shoot this 25 balls a second pretty awesome and when you put the air tank in you are gonna have to unscrew your open valve then you stick the CO2 or air tank in. This does not take CO2. It ruins it. So put the air in. Then after it's in, you wind it up. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. Stay tuned for when it's on. So there you go. You got your air tank on. I'm at one right now. I don't know if you guys is like mine, but it sprays out a crap load of air when it's like that. And you want to keep it off when you do that. There's no paint in my gun. Just dry fire. Just gravity fed. Man, here's auto. Should be auto. One sec. Oh yeah. So as you can see, I have eyes on right now. So to take eyes off. You just press it. Now, if you want to turn it off, then put auto on. And there's auto. It shoots really fast. And if you guys could hear there, there's my mom being a bitch. So yeah, the way you adjust your velocity in the gun is you take your big Allen key, 
fail. And you use there. Clockwise loosens it and counterclockwise tightens it. But I suggest you guys take it to a field before you do it. But yeah, there you go. There is the dangerous power. Dangerous power E1 with eyes and fully automatic. So I suggest you guys buy it. Got my safety gear here. Got my 3000 ounce air, gravity fed hopper, 200 balls. Air, yep. And a really important thing, whenever you take the air tank off, don't think there's no air because there'll still be one or two shots left inside the gun. So after you're done, just point in a safe direction, pull the trigger a couple times. Don't be alarmed if it shoots because it will most likely. So, I still got lots of air left. And if you guys know a way that I can stop it from spraying whenever I put it on or off, please leave it in the comment. Otherwise, please rate the video, subscribe for the latest Call of Duty and paintball and stuff like that. And thanks for watching. Bye.